for it. That's what I think. Um, yeah, no, you're up. Right. I accidentally hit the fucking sprint button. <laughs> Pop some morphine. I don't have morphine. Do you have morphine? Yep. Alright. You guys Let's get do. back in the truck. I'll double check the uh, statics. They should probably be calmed down by now. one guy in the static. I'm going to hit this guy in the static and then if you want to just kind of run up and punch some of those guys in the left hand side and back off. Even if there is an AT guy there, you'll probably get clear of him before he takes a shot. But if you want to wing around to the other side of the road and maybe look at some shots from the hill over there, they're focused on me right now. Very much focused on me right now. Christ, man. This game's impossible. Fucking hell. At least I'm out of the way. I think that we do. There's no blood in there. I looked. I swear to There's God. There's ganj. I'm gonna smoke some ganj. <sighs> and even if he, he's unconscious. What? Yep. Sit trap. Oh. Yeah. I only have 1,000 mil bag in there. I had one on me. Yeah, I had one on me too, but maybe that's why I died. I and then Ange had one, and then I used it, and then that was yeah, it. Maybe that was all we had. Shit. Well, that was fucking embarrassing. See, I got, <sighs> that pain in the ass. That fucking gun is annoying. Got her fucking asses beat. Huh. 
Arg. Well, I think we're going to need to wait until we get a, either a bigger group of guys or a mortar at this point. Uh, maybe. That, um, that checkpoint is bigger than I think and or than we thought, and it's guys just continually get in this. Did we lose the, the truck with the MG? Yeah. Oh, yeah. I'm surprised. Yeah. Did it get rocketed or? It, it was, I kept coming in and out of it. It was on fire. It's done. Yeah. <clears throat> um, I put engine inside it. And we were driving away, and then a grenade hit it. And oh, it, got it. And I couldn't, I I couldn't got get him out in time, and it's caught fire. I got <laughs> I sniped him. off out of the gutter spot. Yeah, well, I saw that pretty early on. It was yeah. incredible. That was very. I didn't think that was going to happen. Yeah, unfortunately. So we got to like twenty thousand dollars. We're actually kind of close to a fucking. Hang on. I don't think I can get a mortar tube here. I think we have to go to somebody. I can just buy vehicles here. Do we have a contact here? I'm like, we have an AAF contact. Maybe he has something that we can buy. What the fuck is my fucking... I thought for sure I grabbed a 152 radio. Oh no, I put it in there, that's why. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> it melted. Standing, we got toggled for your go you guys. Was that the FIA? Might have been the FIA. Get a Lynx for 13 grand. house now. No, we don't have any rep with them. I thought we did when we got Tabu, but that might have been the other guys. Hang on, the reps out there, or our resistance guys out that way. Everybody's dumped all of their money, right? Yeah. Yep. see shit in here. There we go. Hey, uh... Yeah. I'll let you know <clears throat> that uh, Tammy Craps doesn't have parts in her head anymore. Who and what and where? <laughs> yeah, I didn't get Tammy, any of Tammy Craps <laughs> and the doll doesn't have parts in her head anymore. 
Uh, we're looking about 28 grand for a mortar. Ooh. Well, we're almost there. Yeah, another money cycle, and we'll probably be all right. But, and I mean, like I said, then that'll be make the the actual um fuel depot fight a lot easier too. But I I think we're gonna have to unless we're gonna invest in like large swaths of guys. I I just that fucking checkpoint was so much goddamn harder than we thought it was gonna be. Yeah. We way underestimated that. So I think we're just gonna have to wait till that comes through, and then just hit that Sunday, and then try and hit the fuel depot. I don't know what we can do in the meantime, between now and then, if anything. I guess just do little stuff here and there, and just wait till more money comes in. Get a plan. Oh, we've got to. I think we got to redo our supplies here. We got to get some more saline. Yeah. So at some point, one of us should drive into, uh, I think, Bala or uh, Tabu has a pharmacy. Yeah, and just get like 20, 30 bags of like saline. Yeah. And then, Could do um, that right now if you want. Yeah, I guess we got a little bit of time. Do you wanna, uh, I don't know if it matters. Do you wanna make it morning? No, it doesn't, doesn't let's, matter. No, number one, it doesn't matter, and the um, cycle money cycles advance quicker at night. No. It's actually kind of pretty out anyways. Actually, we're going into town anyways. Let's see if there's anything sellable at the warehouse. Tourniquets. Yeah, I guess we don't. Uh, tourniquets. Yeah, we can keep a few. I usually take one with me, but yeah, we only got twelve of those. I'll keep them. Uh -oh. I'm taking the um, binoculars. I'll take the take twenty of the watches. We don't have to stash our stuff going on these towns, do we? Because we can no. Them. No, no. Try and okay. sell the weed off. I'll take that. Put that in there. You boys want to buy some weed? Yeah, I mean, this will be like 1500 bucks or so. Uh, I want to keep the GPS's. We'll take like uh, 20 so or the 20 ish of the compasses. I wonder if we could sell the first aid kits. It seems like something that would sell really well. I'm going to take like 200 of the first aid kits. How many do we have? 300 something. Every NATO guy and every guy, every NATO guy and every cop has a first aid kit. At least one. Oh, that's true, yeah. Sometimes two. Sell the first aid kits. Sell the other stuff and then I'll come back for that. General store? Yeah. God damn it. Annoying motherfuckers. Sell. Binoculars. 
watches and compasses. Got about 1,500 for those. Now, let's buy 50 bags of 250. There. Now, let's see if we can find some civilians and sell some weed to over here. Might as well make some extra money. Stability should be good, so we should get good rate for it. Fuck is everybody? Big it in. Big it in, church. No. No. Guess we'll just try the dock guy and the shopkeepers. Hey, you. Pills guy. Maybe. 137 for the for the bag. I sold it to one of the shopkeepers. Alright, these guys are buying. Every little bit helps, I suppose. So we want to invest the money we have now into buying up houses and then by the time Sunday rolls around, hopefully we'll have it all back. That's not a bad idea. We're going to have to wait a few days anyways. We'll get paid while we do. Well, let's take a look at, at LECA and then we can kind of... Well, next is a lot to buy in LECA because we used up, we bought up most of the fucking houses there. Or most of them are ours. Let me see, what does Musaba have? Musaba has some houses, but I don't know. Mm, back to Tavu. Tavu's got the most ability. Now it's no, 68, that's what it is. But it gets you 15,000 a cycle. Yeah. So, the house is house is over here. Buy for 2700 but then they get you 432 a cycle. So after like five, five cycles, six cycles, then you've got your money back on them. I think it's a good idea to invest because then we'll have probably double the money by the time Sunday rolls around. Well, that's assuming anyone's going to come into play. That's also true. Money always, the money only ticks by and the cycle is the only trip if there's somebody who is there. So, that means either somebody's going to have to kind of come in and play around and get the money set or we're going to be short and have to sit through a few cycles on Sunday. And like, there's wow. not a lot there's not a lot else to do yeah. other than that is the fucking problem. Right. I mean fortunately it seems like it's kind of in a stable spot where like nothing's getting really attacked besides Palavu, which is continually getting fucking pumped full of NATO guys, but But it doesn't make for very compelling gameplay beyond that, unless someone's taking a fucking boat somewhere else, you know? 
but well, then I guess we uh, get the mortar. I mean, as it well, I mean, like as it is right now. So, like, like I said, our options are put the money in, you know, have someone sit through some cycles, and then we'll have enough money for that. And now we've got a larger. So let's see. If we well, well we're at seven something right, or we're like seventy five hundred cycle right now. So if we put in, if we dump everything you know, 20, 20 grand or whatever we have right now into like 10 or so houses. That'll give us another 4,000-ish per cycle. Which means we'd only need two cycles to get back to the 20 grand, well, 28 grand. We need three cycles to get back to what we need for um, a mortar. So, I don't know, maybe it is worth it. I can definitely bump through three cycles, like... I think 2400 is the next one, so I mean, I could just sit in here trip that one tonight, and then... Get get a couple in tomorrow, or something. What if we... Oh no, because it only ticks every six hours, right? Every six in-game hours, which is like an hour and a half real-time-ish. Could leave a person on all night, really. Nah, I don't want to. I don't want to cheese it like that. It's fair. You know, it's it's one thing to kind of bum around for a little bit, but and like I said, I could do, I could do other stuff. I could harass Balabu a little bit, or you know, whatnot. You know, make make it, you know, make good use of the time. Set up, you know, like if we get excess money, buy the mortar. If we get excess money, set up something. You know, set up the something in like Koro so we have something to travel to for the fuel depot like there's st right. there's stuff I can do so how much does stability drop per kill 2% I believe <laughs> the only thing like I said the issue is that like stability never goes up but like it's a 6% right now in Balavo <laughs> so it's it's like another attack is coming soon yeah I, I have no idea why like Stability just perpetually drops in Balabo. They're always in control of it, and there's always a thousand guys there. Yeah, it's not like there's any gangs. Really fucking strange. I mean, honestly, once 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 that rolls around, I don't know. <laughs> we just we just mortar the shit out of Balabo and just I don't know. I don't even think there's any civilians there at this point anymore. Just, yeah. just do that and clear it out that way rather than having to fight the thousand guys that are there. We could probably hit it with the mortar and the gunboats. Yeah, we just have to make sure that all the AT guys are cleared out so the gunboats don't get rocketed. All right, right. All right, let me take this all this money. 21837. Uh... So I'm going to do this. If you guys want to take the truck back to Lekka and unload all the supplies. So we've got lots in the way of sailing now. So we should be set for that. I'll buy up these houses and then I'll... And then I'll I'm sure I got like a something around here I can take back. There's a uh, quad bike right over there. Yeah, I see it. I can take that. Or there was a jeep down by that way. I think around the back of this house, of the one of these houses is a jeep I can take up. So. Oh yeah. Okay. I'll do that. You guys bring that back. We'll call it a night. Like I said, I'll I'll try and probably sit here till like midnight, which is another uh, 15, 20 minutes or so, and then um, and then I'll try and get a couple more cycles in before Sunday. That should be enough for us to get the mortar we need, and then we should be good to go. Alright. Alright. Okay. Alright, see you guys. Yeah, yeah.